welcome back to our channel or welcome if you are new here my name is Emily and in today's video I just figured I would show you guys my healthy Trader Joe's staples when I go grocery shopping there I am absolutely obsessed with Trader Joe's and I know a lot of you guys are too even though I know some of you guys are from Canada and you guys don't have it and that's seriously so tragic like I feel so bad but if you aren't from Canada, then I hope you guys can find some new ideas from this haul. I don't even know if people care about Trader Joe's hauls anymore. I used to watch them all the time, um, but I haven't done one of these in a really long time. So I got a couple new things, but most of this stuff is things that I always grab when I go there. So yeah, let's go ahead and get into what I picked up from Trader Joe's. I'm about to head to the gym, so that's why I look like this in case you're wondering this jacket is from lululemon this sports bra is from amazon it's so soft and comfortable this is from our recent amazon fitness haul and i can't stop wearing these sports bras you guys i'm obsessed so check out that video if you haven't already same with this water bottle i've been obsessed with this too I definitely want to start doing more fitness related content for you guys because I know you guys have been wanting to see that so I will be filming a what I eat in the day kind of video here soon so yeah but anyways let's talk about food because I know y'all love food as much as me at least I hope so this isn't fun but baby spinach absolutely necessary I throw it in my protein shakes my smoothies it just as your greens and it's a good source of iron especially if you are more plant-based I try not to eat much meat so sometimes you can lack iron when you're not eating meat especially red meat so it's important that you have greens in your diet people I'm not kidding greens are your best friend sneak them in when you can I hate the taste of them personally so that's why I like to have the spinach that I can just throw in my smoothies um, so I don't taste it but also I picked up two of my favorite salads these are the pre-made salads so these are kind of when I'm having a busy day and I'm too lazy to kind of sit down and make a lunch or dinner. But these are the organic kale chicken Caesar salads. These are so flipping good. Me and Abby are obsessed with them. I can't get enough of them. So then I picked up some organic frozen raspberries, some organic frozen strawberries, and some organic mango. These are all obviously for smoothies. I'm gonna throw these in the freezer really quick before they get all nasty and soggy also picked up two of these meatless breakfast patties if you are new here then you wouldn't know about these but me and Abby have been talking about these for so long we absolutely love them they taste delicious and one of these is 80 calories four and a half grams of fat two grams of carbs and nine grams of protein in one of these so that's really good I also picked up some hash browns because I've heard that if you throw these in the air fryer they come out perfect and taste like the McDonald's ones and when I'm hungover, that's all I want is hash browns. So, and then um, these are my two favorite low calorie sweet treats. I have a sweet tooth. I have to have dessert almost every night. It doesn't feel like the night is complete without it. And I will not give up my sweets. Like that's something I won't do. So the first dessert is the ice cream bonbons. These are the vanilla with chocolate cookie crust. These are so good. You can get away with eating a few of them and it's still pretty low calorie. Same with these mini hold the cone ice cream cones. I like the chocolate chip flavor. It's just nice to have those, especially you know when it's that time of the month and you just need something sweet. Um, also got this low fat chicken chow mein. This stuff is so good. You guys, if you haven't tried it, highly recommend that you pick this up next time you're there. I don't think it's like super healthy, but it's not terrible. Then I picked up some shredded mozzarella cheese. So fun. Then I got two of these protein bars. These are mine and Abby's, like one of our favorite protein bars. They're so good, but these are definitely like a meal replacement bar. I'll usually take these if I have a long day at work or I'm gonna be out and about running errands all day because these are a pretty dense bar, but these are the Go Macro Macro Bars in the oatmeal chocolate chip flavor. And when these are a little bit warm and like soft, it tastes kind of like cookie dough. They're so good. Then I got just some bananas. Organic, of course, and then I got some avocados, some raspberries, organic raspberries. I feel like I try my best to get organic when it comes to berries just because I know that there's a lot of pesticides and stuff in berries, so you have to be careful. I still wash all my fruit though, and you should too. Make sure you're washing your fruit, guys. It's kind of nasty. So I did get a few pre-made dinners just for when I'm feeling lazy because 
let's be honest i'm always lazy when it comes to cooking i just I'm, i live by myself i'm not cooking for anybody so i just don't like get excited about cooking dinner so these are really nice and easy so these are the stuffed peppers with ground turkey i've had them before and i really like them they're not amazing but it's a nice healthy dinner and then i also got these which these are fire you guys go buy these if you haven't tried them you need these in your life they're so good also got some microwavable brussels sprouts because again lazy then I got these plant-based burgers, protein patties, because I try to not eat red meat, so those are nice if I'm like craving a burger, but obviously don't want to eat red meat. Um, I got some chicken breast, some reduced sodium turkey breast, and then this is my recent obsession. I love this stuff. This is the grainless granola. It's sweet and salty clusters made with almonds, coconut, sunflower seeds, and pumpkin seeds. This is so good in the yogurt that I always get from Trader Joe's with cut up strawberries or just blueberries, raspberries, whatever. It's such a good yogurt parfait. And I don't know what it is about this flavor, but it's so good. This is better than the protein, the peanut butter protein one that Abby and I used to be obsessed with. This has definitely replaced that. And this is vegan and gluten free. So if you are vegan, gluten free, you definitely need that. Then I also got these pita bite crackers with sea salt. I try not to have too many crackers and chips in the house because I tend to snack on them mindlessly. So I try to avoid it, but I couldn't resist because of this. I saw this on TikTok, I think it was. It's this buffalo style chicken dip. And someone said this was like the best thing ever. I don't think it's healthy, but sometimes you just gotta indulge and treat yourself. Also, this is the yogurt I was talking about. This is the Trader Joe's Greek yogurt with honey. This is really good. This is not the healthiest, so, so be careful. That's why I got the tub instead of the little mini ones. So that way I can just kind of scoop out a little bit at a time. So this will last me a really long time, but it's so good. The texture, the flavor, on point. Then I picked up my favorite kombucha. This is the Synergy. Raw kombucha, strawberry lemonade flavor. Mine and Abby's favorite flavor. Yeah, I'm actually gonna pop it open right now. I just love it so much. Mm. And I love like the carbonation that it has because it kind of replaces any cravings that I have for soda. I picked up some oat milk. Not much to say about this. This is what I put in my smoothies as my base or my protein shakes. Um, and I got some organic vodka sauce. I love this vodka sauce. Also, not the healthiest, but the reason that I got it was to put it with this pasta that I've been hearing people talk about. I actually got this from Fred Meyer, but this is the um, Bonza pasta made from chickpeas. So this is supposed to be like a healthier pasta. So I figured it would be good, maybe like some ground turkey with vodka sauce. And this pasta, if I'm ever craving pasta, I don't crave it very often. I'm not big on pasta, but sometimes I get that craving. So I just like to have it in the house just in case, you know, because you never know. The last couple of things I got is just some tuna. <laughs> so fun, ew. You know, sometimes you gotta sacrifice to get the gains. So that's what that's for. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this little Trader Joe's haul. I know I haven't done one of these in a while, so I figured I would just give you guys a little updated one. I'm not sure if I'm gonna just end this video and have it be a separate video, if I'm gonna throw it in a vlog. I haven't really been vlogging this week. I've been really busy, and it's now Saturday, and tomorrow I'm busy too, so hopefully I can end up vlogging something more than just this and either throw it in here, but if not, then we'll end it now. Either way, thank you for watching. Hey babes, I'm back. It has now been a few days since I went to Trader Joe's and why not share with you guys what I eat in a day and just giving you guys a quick warning. I don't track calories. I don't track macros. I just kind of eat what I want, but I make sure it's relatively healthy. I'm not a super big health freak or anything like that. So this isn't going to be like, you know, super low calorie, low carb, low sugar. I like to eat what I want to eat, but I just try and make sure that it's healthy. And everyone has a different, you know, definition of what healthy is, but this is my definition of healthy. I know that, you know, some people may think that this is very unhealthy. Some people may think this is super healthy. 
So I just want to point that out that I am in no way telling you what to eat. You shouldn't eat what I eat. This is just what I like to eat. I know that sounds silly to even say, but I swear, you know, some people will really take this seriously. Anyways, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and make sure that you like it if you want more of these videos because I can definitely do them for you guys. But anyways, I'm really hungry. It is now 10.45. Oh, jeez, all those text messages. Oh my gosh, I just got like 10 messages of packages that just got delivered. Well, looks like I might have to show you guys some things I've recently bought. I feel like I'm always showing you guys things in vlogs that I buy, but I have a shopping problem. Tell me you have a shopping problem without telling me you have a shopping problem. These are all package notifications. It doesn't end. Yeah. I can't be tamed. But anyways, let's go ahead and have some breakfast because like I said, I'm really hungry. And then after I have breakfast, I'm going to go to the gym, get in a leg day. And yeah, so first things first, I'm drinking water. And this has helped me so much, you guys. I swear I was struggling for a while not drinking enough water. But this has really helped and it's so cute. I love it so much. Also, in case you were curious, this is also one of the tops that we talked about as well as this jacket. Well, I don't think we talked about this jacket, but this is just the Hanes zip up um, jacket and I have it linked in my Amazon store. As always, that will be linked in the description. But anyways, here I am talking too much as always. So here is breakfast. It doesn't look very good, but trust me guys this is so good so this is just avocado toast with an egg one piece of turkey bacon and in case you were wondering i put everything but the bagel seasoning some crushed red pepper and a little bit of pink himalayan salt on the avocado and then here i have just some of that honey greek yogurt some cut up strawberries and the grain free granola you guys absolutely have to try this i'm telling you it's so so good so i'm gonna be having this for breakfast and then I'm going to probably mix up some pre-workout and then hit the gym and I'll probably see you guys when I get back. Alright guys, at this point I'm convinced I'm the reason that Jeff Bezos is as rich as he is because I have multiple packages coming like daily from Amazon. Honestly, I don't even remember what I ordered, but let's find out, shall we? Okay guys, let's see what's in here. This is so exciting. So, oh, okay. So this is from TikTok, of course. TikTok has been making me buy so many things lately. I'm obsessed. Um, you should follow me on TikTok, me and Abby. By the way, it's just Mickey Night Twins. I've been posting some things on there and I plan on being more consistent on TikTok because it's so fun and easy. Ooh, but this is so cute. So this is a workout set, which I know we just did a fitness haul and I did not need this, but obviously I saw it on TikTok and I was like, okay, gotta have it because it's, nude ribbed just you know totally my vibe i actually ordered another color too like a dark gray black one with like contouring that i'm hoping is flattering to wear to the gym this one's more for lounging but this is really nice and thick i got this in a size small medium this might be a little small it looks really really tiny like these look so small but they're pretty stretchy I don't know. Oh, I think they'll be fine. Yeah, they're pretty stretchy. So I really love this color. Oh my goodness. I do want to try it on, but I'm feeling really lazy. Like, honestly, my workout was such trash because I am PMSing and I have the worst cramps ever. I haven't even eaten anything since this morning because my stomach just hurts. Um, but after I do this, I'm going to actually have a protein shake just because... I haven't eaten anything since breakfast and I feel like I need to. My stomach's starting to feel a little bit better, but yeah, that was not fun. Okay, what's this? Oh, okay. So I got a Bluetooth speaker for my shower. Also saw this on TikTok. It's nice because you can control your phone and the music from this speaker and it kind of just suctions to um, the shower wall. This is just going to elevate my shower experience. <laughs> Of these things cool so i got these creaseless hair clips for when i'm doing my makeup because um i don't have any of those and everyone talks about those and it's nice because you know i don't like to always put my hair up when i'm doing my makeup and stuff just because it does crease so it's nice to just have those to clip my hair out of the way and then um i got these blue light glasses let's see hopefully these are cute oh they don't, they don't look very cute 
because I've just been on my phone a lot lately between YouTube, Instagram, my business and everything. I'm just on my phone or laptop a lot. So I figured I needed another pair because I keep losing my other ones. These are just like basic ones. Are these cute? Can you guys see? It's like reflective. Cause it's like really bright outside. But these are cute. They're, they're kind of grandma-y, but you know what? That's okay. They're not really meant to be that cute. They're meant to protect my eyes. So I can deal with them being a little grandma-y. I mean, no one's really gonna see me in them. So it doesn't really matter anyways. <laughs> Okay, what else do we got here? This is so fun. I love online shopping, but Amazon might make me broke with how much I'm always shopping on there, but you guys enjoy the videos and I'm actually doing another Amazon video here soon. So I'm excited about that. Oh, okay. These are not fun. <laughs> these are the Shout Wipe and Go Instant Stain Removers. I kind of got these for my couch. I'm scared to try it on them. Um, but I'm also gonna put these in like my purse and my car because I'm always wearing white, as you guys know, always, always wearing white or like neutral colors. And so whenever there's a stain on it, I freak out and it sucks. So I've heard these are really, really good. So got those, I actually got a lot of them. I didn't realize that I got, jeez. If you're ever hanging out with me and you need a shop wipe, let me know, I got you, girl. So this is just something for YouTube. It's just a light to put in my camera. Not very exciting. Okay, also not exciting. This is also for my couch. This is Folex Instant Carpet Spot Remover, but I've heard this is good to clean your couch. So it says it removes pet accidents, grease, ink, red wine, coffee, blood, rust, food, cosmetics, dirt, grime, most old stains, and it's also excellent for upholstery. So that's what we need. So I'm happy to have that. I feel a little bit more safe now that I have like some options in case I do stain my couch, God forbid, but um, it's bound to happen. So I just need to be prepared for that moment. Oh, this is so fun. Actually, I'm really excited about this. <laughs> this is the Abby has this and she says she loves it. This is just the Black & Decker um, cordless hand vacuum, which I really need because my hair gets everywhere. And you know, if crumbs or anything get on my couch, it's just nice to have a small handheld one. Honestly, I have another one already, so I might just put this one in my car or put the other one in my car because my hair just gets everywhere. In my car, in my apartment, it's just really annoying. So, and then this last thing that I got, TikTok also made me buy this, but girl, I am so excited. This is an LED light mirror for your um, car visor, you know, your little ooh, mirror. Okay, let me see if I can open this. So it comes with a little charger cord and then you just kind of Velcro this to your visor and when you pull it down, you can turn it on and you have a light so you can freshen up your makeup in the car when it's dark. That's like the main reason why I got it. Where I live, there's a lot of parking garages and when I park, I wanna like freshen up my lipstick or something, but it's so dark. So this will definitely come in handy. Maybe I'll insert a clip of me putting it in my car here because I'm probably gonna put this in either today or tomorrow. What is this? Oh, they gave me a scrunchie. <laughs> Inks. Okay, so that was a fun little Amazon haul. I mean, not super exciting, but I did get some cool stuff. So hope you guys enjoyed that on the millionth episode of Emily has a shopping addiction, specifically an Amazon addiction. I might need rehab. Is that a thing? It should be a thing, because I'm sure a lot of us need that. Um, but anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and have a protein shake now because it's been a while, what time is it? So I had breakfast at like 11, so it's almost three now, so it's time for some food. Or not food, I'm not going to eat, but, Abby has me hooked on these, you guys. She was not kidding, these are fire. So this is the Core Power High Protein Shake Chocolate. Oh my God, I hope I don't spill this on my white crew neck. This is also from Amazon, by the way. <laughs> surprise, surprise. But these are so good. It's just like chocolate milk. Mm. And one of these is only 170 calories, four and a half grams of fat, eight grams of carbs, 
five grams of sugar and 26 grams of protein. So mm, I'm gonna drink that and that will probably hold me over probably until dinner. I don't know, I'm really not hungry today and that's not like me, usually I'm super hungry all the time, but I think my cramps are just like making me feel full and gross. So yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and put all that stuff away, tidy up my apartment a little bit and I'll see you guys when I see you guys. Okay girls, so I figured I would not be lazy and I would try it on for you guys because I know that I would wanna see it on because it's so stinking cute. Um, I will say this is definitely tight like these run small but it is still really freaking cute so here it is my slippers also from amazon but um yeah i think it's adorable i do love this color so so much it's nice and thick like it's not going to be see-through at all it is kind of stretchy but it's definitely tight still so another thing i want to quickly point out is that it does kind of give you a camel toe just a little bit so if that bothers you, then you will not like this, but Gymshark gives you camel toe too, and it's way more expensive. Maybe when I lose a few more pounds, it'll fit better. I'm still trying to tone up my stomach and, you know, slim out a bit. So maybe once I do that, this will fit better, but yeah, here it is. Super cute, and I absolutely love the color, and they do have more colors. I think I actually ordered... I might have even ordered like a darker nude color too. I'm not sure, but. All right guys, it is now five o'clock and perfect time to open a white claw. Am I right or am I right? I really just wanted one of these. It's just, it's just been a day. I mean, it hasn't been a bad day. It's been a good day. It's been pretty productive with things around my apartment and whatnot, but you know, I'm just PMSing and I'm feeling a little emotional. So I figured I needed to pop open a white claw. Abby loves the mango flavor. I love the black cherry. So I'm gonna have one of those. And then I'm gonna go ahead and have um, a snack, which my favorite snack lately has just been a piece of the Dave's Killer thin sliced bread with either almond butter or peanut butter and cinnamon. So that's what I'm gonna have as a snack, just one piece. And then for dinner, I'm just gonna have those microwavable brussels sprouts chicken breast and jasmine rice um that's gonna be my dinner just so you guys know i feel like i just want to stop vlogging and just like get comfy and finish this out because i mean there's really no point in me showing you what it looks like i'm a really bad cook anyways so it's not gonna look cute or good or appetizing in the slightest but yeah, so just chicken, Brussels sprouts, rice for dinner, and then I'll probably have one of those um, ice cream cones for dessert. Those little hold the cones from Trader Joe's, the chocolate chip ones. I'll probably have one or two of those. And then I'm just gonna watch YouTube the rest of the night. I feel like this vlog probably is already long anyways. Um, I suck at what I eat in a day videos, but I hope you guys enjoyed anyway. So we love you guys so, so much, and I can't wait to see you guys in the next video. So cheers. XOXO. XO.